Welcome to the testing world. In this session, I'll show you how we can create a Ruby project which will integrate with the Cucumber and we are going to start Ruby with Cucumber. So first of all, I'm here on the Eclipse. So here I'm going to create a new Ruby project. So file new and a Ruby project. I'm giving Ruby Cucumber automation. So here a new project is created. We do not have any architecture here. Because we want to work with the Cucumber, in Cucumber we have to create feature file as well as step definition file. Cucumber suggests its own architecture. So how to generate that architecture? Just copy the path where this project is saved. So I'm right clicking on the project properties and here this is the location. Copy this location and go to the command prompt. So from the command prompt, move to this location. So I'm moving to this location. Now we need to write Cucumber. Cucumber must be installed in your system. We have already installed Cucumber package in the previous session. So I'm just writing Cucumber hyphen hyphen in it. And it's going to generate a project architecture. So now it has generated the architecture. Go to the Eclipse again, close this window, refresh the project. So once you refresh that project, here you can see we are getting that feature and also we are getting the step definition. So in this features, we are going to write our feature files and here in the step definitions, we are going to write our step definitions file. So we have generated that Cucumber project architecture by using command prompt. So this architecture we are going to follow while automating our test cases using Cucumber with Ruby. So here in this session we have seen how, how we can set up Ruby Cucumber project. That's all we have for this session. Thanks for watching this video.